Yep, this time I planned it for the train to be in the background, because I heard it coming. I am Katana. I am the Lightning Cat. Channel update time. Well, for me, anyway. This is more just, uh... Yep, it's more of a skookum choo <laughs> Right, okay. First! What the box playlist? That's just for screwing around maybe once a month at most. That's just a... Well, it's a game that uh, if I play too much all at once, it'll get really boring really quickly. So I'm going to space that one out. That way I don't get bored of it. And then, uh, where to farm what in Warframe? Survivals. I'll expand and I'll do the other mission types, uh, eventually. So, hey, Balto. Look at him. Well, look at what he's doing. He's getting up and saying hello. My advice and feedback for D about Warframe. That's just going to happen whenever I come up with an idea. And I'm going to have to write them all down. That way I don't repeat myself too much. <coughs> <coughs> Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Vegas 2. I don't have a schedule for that one. So... If... When I make another one... And I will go through the whole campaign. Just be patient with me. Don't starve together. Same deal. Skyrim. Yeah. that I'm going to take my time with that one as well. Uh, Warframe with friends. <coughs> <coughs> as of right now. I've got. One video each week for that one scheduled all the way through January the something. So when I do that and stream it, then it gets put on to the, uh, the weekly Warframe Wednesday playlist, which I just call Warframe with Friends. Fallout 4... Uh, I'll get to it when I get to it. Just be patient. Unboxings, same deal. That's going to be an obscure, randomly assorted playlist. After I finally get enough um, support to actually do unboxings. Mostly it's just space filler. But that's a secret. Don't tell my subscribers. And clicker heroes I'm gonna wait until I get further in before I do some more recording in that the wake up vlogs yeah you'll get them when I wake up I'm gonna try and keep them daily keyword is try I'm gonna put the effort in to keep them daily ratchet and clank I'm gonna wait until I get a decent capture card device to actually plug into my PlayStation 2 and then I'm gonna redo the whole playlist uh, the ones I have right here I'll rename the playlist uh, appropriately I'll put in a little bracket that says uh, poorly recorded on my camera phone then I'll make a whole new playlist and hopefully it'll be much better Vlogging, that's just going to be whenever I feel froggy about it and jump on top of it. Minecraft. Eh. Same deal as vlogging, just whenever I feel like playing it. Cat videos. As you can see, we have full integration of the cat into the video. He got up onto my lap and made himself in this video. So, you know, whenever Balto feels like demanding attention while I'm recording, you'll see him. <coughs> <coughs> Getting technical. I had, on my previous channel, a video 
called Mathematic Conceptuals or Conceptual Mathematics. The channel that YouTube deleted because I was advertising for myself instead of buying into their advertising system. Let me just outline the base for that. The basis of that video. Math is based on the preconceptualized notion that one and one is two. When in higher dimensionals, it could be three. Uh, good example. Man plus woman will eventually equal three. Because the coefficient is time. Is the coefficient the right word here? Oh. The variable is time. Well, conceptually, the variable is time, but in reality, time is not a thing that exists. The fourth dimension is movement, not time. For example, in the three-dimensional space, we'll just label it A, B, C, and D, <coughs> Four separate points just randomly assorted by whatever configuration you'd like to put them in. The first two make a line. The third one makes it a plane with an X and Y axis. And the fourth one gives it the Z axis. The fourth dimension on top of that is movement. You move the object around in within that three-dimensional space and you record its movement. You record point on the graph. You record its movement based on the preconceptualized notion of time, of how fast it travels. See, when you tear down the base fundamentals, it resets everything. So, now, jumping to the conceptual part that I was talking about, a circle. 360 degrees. That's just a baseline for comparison. Whoever designed that put it at that many degrees as a baseline for comparison. If you draw a circle of um, two inch diameter and you fit yay so many points on it and you get all 360 of them there, if you expand the circumference of that circle to an 8 inch circle and you're using points that are the same diameter as the points that were on the 2 inch circle you can fit more degrees of rotation in that circle thus proving that all math is based on hideously limiting conceptualizations the problem is uh, for me, the problem is trying to change the verbiage from time being the fourth dimension to movement. <clears throat> ah, yes, speed. <coughs> <coughs> that changes speed as well. So instead of going inches, feet, meters, miles, or kilometers per a given measurement of time you have to have a constant movement like a metronome and it has to go yay so many inches or centimeters and the movements have to be consistent concise and instead of saying time they have to flow evenly so what's a better word? What's a better word than time? There's another YouTube channel who could help with this. Um, bloody forgot the name of that YouTube channel. Mm, I'm going to beat myself on the head later for this one when I finally remember. I draw a complete blank. 
Anyway, replacing time mathematically is not going to be easy <coughs> because it's a conceptualized perception of speed, velocity, and how congruent or incongruent it is in comparison with another set trajectory of speed and velocity. Or basically a vector. A vector denoting direction and speed. That's what a vector is. It's commonly referred to as the arrow. You know, a little... That bit. Anyway, that's enough for this time. Get it? Because I just said time is a joke. It doesn't exist. Anyway, I'll see in another video, or you'll see me in another video next time. Till then, everyone. Bye.